Well, hello everybody. This is Street Outlaws No Prep Talk. Today we're going to talk about the Grade Eight and race your way in results and the current Grade Eight point standings. Now, photo go directly to their photo owners. Please subscribe and comment, and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Street Outlaws No Prep Kings race series and all the other Street Outlaw shows. So, these are the current Grade Eight point standings after last night's Grade Eight in Idaho. So, Kakali won it. Unsurprisingly, he was rolling yesterday. I really thought Lizzie could win it, but Kai Kelly whooped everybody, and he has a massive lead over everybody. As you may see, second place is 17 points behind Kai. That is a lot of rounds. Now, he is followed by Giuseppe, which actually rounded up yesterday, then followed by Axeman, Damon, and then Ryan, David Gates, and Kayla, then Callie Mills, Nate Saylor, and then a triple tie for 10th, Lissy, Chuck55, and Jim Howe. Lissy got her first round win yesterday in the grade 8, and she was flying. I really thought that she could actually win it, but we are still really early in the season, but Kai Kelly has a massive 17-point lead. Now, these are the race your way in results from yesterday. Now, we had a couple of cars that had to race their way in to be in the Invitational. And we had Bodie that beat Chris Rankin, Jerry Bird that beat Mike Morello, Clay Cole that beat Mike Bowman, Jimmy Taylor, another future guy that beat Chuck Seitzinger, Birdman beat Disco Dean. Disco apparently is still struggling, and Birdman seems to be running pretty good. Jim Howe beat Tony McKinney, and John Odom beat... Page constant. Now, why Jim Howe has to race his way in, I'm not sure. He is 13th in points. Maybe if you put somebody in reserves, and since John Odom didn't have to race his way in last race, maybe he has to race his way in again. I'm not real sure. But he is 13th in points right now, and he actually won the race your way in race against Tony McKinney. Look for it in upshift. I don't think Tony McKinney is going to stay on Swanson's team. I mean, he wasn't even close to Jim Howe. I don't know if he had issues, but he has failed to make the invitation on a lot. I think Sonstrom's going to draft somebody else and put him in reserves. I'm not real sure, but let's see what happens in Bandemir. So, Kai Kelly is dominating the individual championship. I get a lot of comments asking me or telling me that the grade 8 doesn't have any weight this year. Well, it does because... The individual championship, which is $100,000, is given to whoever wins the grade 8 at the end of the season. So Kai is sitting pretty and sitting very comfortable right now with a massive lead over the runner-up currently, which is Giuseppe, and over everybody else. So yes, the Screwblown Hemi is dominating the individual championship, and this year apparently is... Kai Kelly's time to shine. He is definitely doing really good, and he is second in points in the main event point standing. So let's see what happens today. It's going to be a very interesting race, and let's see how everybody does today.